Derek, a tough day again today, coming away with nothing, but it was a game that you were very competitive in. What's your take on it? Yeah, I felt for the first, I don't know when he scored the first goal, maybe 65 minutes. I think it was a, an even match, I think. Both teams had the chances. I had a good save in the first half. The keepers had a couple of saves as well. And I think that the game could have went either way. Um, we get caught in the counter-attack. Yeah, fair work on our kick. The ball is broken. We gave away a penalty kick and they put it away and then um, they've managed to see the game out really well and get a, added a second later on to put a wee bit of gloss in the result. But it's obviously frustrating because it's another game where we've lost at home and we failed to score a goal. But um, I think over the, I think for, for about 65 minutes, um, the game could have went either way. Yeah, if we're looking at positives from the, the season so far, I mean, defensively, you've still been <coughs> pretty pretty good. You know, the, the back four has been solid. You're, you've still had a number of shutouts yourself. In fact, you've conceded fewer goals than, than air, and they're top of the league. So the, the difficulty seems to be at the other end is actually turning the possession and the pressure you have into, into goals. Would that be a fair reflection, or, or how would you see it? Um, no, I think we're still quite disappointed with the amount of goals we have conceded. Um, I know in comparison to air, we've maybe conceded less, but I think we've still conceded far too many goals as we were like and giving away far too many chances throughout the season so far. Mm. Um, we understand that to win games of football, we're probably going to need to keep clean sheets at, at the worst. Concede one goal, we can't be conceding two goals at home and expect to win games. Um, the defence, obviously, you mentioned the back four myself, but the defending comes as a whole team, I think. When we've been successful, it's been the whole team's defended well as a as a unit rather than mm. the back four. I know they get the plaudits, but I think as a team we need to, we need to defend a wee bit better. Yeah, team <clears throat> I can't fault the, the team for effort again today, and I think that's been the case all all through the season. The results just aren't quite going your way, but that seems to be the nature of the the division this this season. You know, it's still relatively tight. I know we're bottom. Um, but there's not a lot of points between all the teams and you see from some of the results today you know anything can happen any week so yeah. do you still feel positive that you know things will turn around and it's just needing that that wee bit of a break just to get a couple of results put together yeah I think when you're bottom of the league it's top verse well top verse ninth it was today um, any kind of our matches you end up seeing, seeing so often that the team at the top of the league get the wee breaks and get the goal, the first goal, and the team at the bottom hit the post and can't get the ball in the net. Um, we just need to get that wee, that wee break, I think, to just kick us on just now. But <clears> uh, we're confident, we're getting every week confident of getting the result. Um, I think the, result, yeah, the performances have picked up a wee bit in recent weeks, but we've still only got one win to show for it in the, the recent weeks. And we really need to, to add to that and start picking up wins and putting runs together. We are winning two and three games and propel ourselves up the league, but we are confident that we're able to, to change that. And as you said, the results every week is in the league's um, quite shocking at times when you when you see it, but um, we just need to get ourselves on the right side of a few results just now. Okay, thanks very much. All no the problem. Best. Cheers.